What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking a look at an Iron Studios 1 tenth scale statue of the Green Ranger. All right, and as always, we start off with the packaging. And as you guys can see, a nice big picture of the Green Ranger in the front. We got Power Rangers on the top left. We got one tenth scale on the right. It says Green Ranger on the bottom left. And it has the Iron Studio symbol to the right corner. Really cool. I like how it has that circle around the Green Ranger with the lightning going uh, through the background. Really nice touch. And then it's got that, I don't know if it's coming across on camera, but it's like a green shade. Uh, like a green shade going through the black on the on the box. So really nice, really nice little um, artwork and nice style from the front cover. But let's uh, let's turn this thing around and actually see the side. So on the side, Green Ranger, Iron Studios. Then on the back, we got a nice picture of the statue itself. And uh, the Iron Studios symbol, World to Collect. And then let's see anything on the top. The top just says Power Rangers, Green Ranger. And then the bottom, <clears throat> let me see, it has the UPC. I don't know if this is going to help anybody because, I mean, I'm pretty sure you have to order this on online through their uh, through their website. But there it is, <laughs> and upside down too. Sorry about that, guys. But that's enough of that. Let's get this guy out. All right, and much like the rest of the battle diorama, it the base is of the command center. And really, really cool, man. I mean, this thing, this has a lot of detail as a single piece. As you guys can see, you got that nice silver on the stairs. You got that, like, metallic blue. There's, like, uh, the wiring and the pipes on the sides here, which is really nice. Really cool. Some components and stuff. Nothing on the back, obviously. Just kind of plain. But it's got that nice metallic blue. Just a lot of detail here. So just having the piece by itself is actually very nice. By, you know, solo, but it's even better if you get it together. There's the uh, peg hole for where the Green Ranger is going to be standing. And speaking of the Green Ranger, let's bring him in. And here he is, right out of the packaging. As you guys can see, he does not have his right hand attached. It comes separately. But man, look at the work on this guy. The green is very vibrant, very, like, oh man, just that dark green. You got the white, just pure white. The gold really shines on this character. Like, they did such a good job on this. Look at this. Look how that gold just shines. So cool, man. Now let's plug him in. And there it is. Smooth, easy. Can't really say much else about that. Really, really nice. Paint apps are beautiful on him. Looks so good. There's the uh, the, the hand with the dagger. Comes separately. Let's see if we can get the camera to focus on the detail on the dagger. Look at that. You got the silver, the gold, the green. You got the coin on the... Hilt of the sword of the dagger there, the mouthpiece for the flute. Really nice. And then this goes like that. And there it is. Popped in very, very easily. Look at it. Look, what a great looking piece. It's so cool. Iron Studios is doing such a good job with these one tenth scales. I love these one tenth scales personally. I'm still trying to get the rest of the Rangers, but I gotta go slow, guys. You know, so I appreciate you guys being patient with me because uh, I think these retail for like 170 bucks around there. So they're not exactly cheap, but I think for what you get, this thing is so cool. Especially being a big Power Rangers fan, and you got a you got a nice amount of weight on that base too, so it doesn't feel cheap and like you know flimsy. It actually feels like a good good piece and it looks great with all that work on the details and the color and the paint apps really awesome i think they did a great job i am looking forward to getting the other rangers in hand and uh sharing it with you guys so i really appreciate you guys for uh you know thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one later